hey it's Joe B with the Mach 1 just putting in a little extra work this is a kind of a follow-up to well the bodywork and the lining of the panels and stuff uh, let me show you some things the lining, lining of the body runs from the quarter panel so as long as the quarter panels are in shape along the doors to the front fenders and then you get your hood all set and you get your, your gaps nice um, the problem I was having was lining up the door was going really well using the bolts in the front here accessible here and then by removing the fender you access them through here there's two brackets but the problem is when I was closing the door I was getting a bad line right here between the door and the quarter panel and that's because at some point I think when they painted it they painted over the original grabber blue with the red when they painted it they they moved them so I couldn't get these off I, I couldn't get the door striker off even with an impact wrench, uh, I was hammering on it, screws must have got locked tight or something on there. So when it really came down to it, what I did is I just took out the grinder and um, oh, it's still hot, oh it's still hot, but this is, the, <laughs> this is the original piece and I just did a grind as you can see on the top and then I did a grind on the bottom and just used a hammer and a screwdriver and just muscled it off of there. That's, that's the everyday Joe Layman's way of doing it right there, okay. Um, I'm no expert but the nice thing is I didn't mar the metal of the door and I did have a couple of little nicks from the grinder right here and here but those will come out with the sanding and prepping for getting the original grabber blue paint back on I uh, just wanted to give a little peek at it halfway through because it had these little shim plates uh, you can even see the the original screw right there I'm gonna have to use some pliers to get that out, channel locks probably and once this is removed then I can get the new plate piece and of course cost plays a big part I did some research and you can get a new striker plate with the screws on CJ Pony for $19.99 so the bolts alone the little screws I originally started by trying to drill out the top one and, and it wasn't happening um, so I just went full blast brute force so I will order the new plate and get it in place do the alignment and then probably um, probably either score it or use a sharpie and then pull it back off so that I can start some prep and that's where we're at with the Mach 1 on the lining of the door this is Joe B I'll talk to you later